The following story has been brought to you by storiestoinspire.org. It was visiting day in camp. And visiting day is the delight of every child waiting in anticipation for their parents to come and visit them in camp to see what they've been doing. And all the children were watching as this incredible limousine pulled up to camp. And everyone was ooing and ahhing at this most special car. Wow, which parent is this? Which child has such a parent like this? I'm so jealous. And then this limousine went onto the area of the grass that says, do not step on. And everyone was, well, I guess if you have money, you can do whatever you want. There are no rules. Until they found out the real reason for the limousine and who he was coming to visit. There was a father of two children in the camp that was terminally ill, so weak, so ill, that he wasn't able to make the trip to go and visit his kids in camp. But he was desperate to do so. He's so longing to see his kids, and there wasn't long left. So they arranged, and had Sola had paid for, a huge limousine that had the ability to fit a bed inside, and they were able to bring him to the camp to be able to visit his children. And all of a sudden, nobody was so jealous. The Torah tells us specifically that when we're jealous of someone, we look at something specific. We see their business, we see their car, we see their vacations, we see certain aspects of their success. And the Torah is telling us when you judge someone, when you look at someone, when you want to be jealous of someone, judge the whole person. Look at the whole picture. Everybody has their peckle. Everybody has their little issues, whether it's issues in Parnassah, whether it's Shalom Bias, whether it's children. It could be so many things. And when we're jealous, we're often jealous of just one part, but not every part. We have to learn to look at the whole picture. Have a wonderful Shabbos. Enjoyed this story? Come again. Bring a friend. StoriesToInspire.org.